I wanted to show you some of the details of the wall. Uh, you can say you can see a pretty good view. Uh, this is going to be close to 500 miles by the time we finish. Those are the areas that are most important. Uh, after we're completed, five that should be done pretty close to next year. Over, it'll be over 400 miles, and we think we can get it close to 500 miles by the end of next year. The wall is 30 feet high. We also have 18-foot wall. We have a combination of 30 feet and 18, depending on the area, depending on the, uh, on the importance. Uh, Tijuana is right over here. There are thousands of people over there that had been trying to get in. Uh, tremendous cooperation from Mexico, and uh, the president of Mexico has been fantastic. All of Mexico has been fantastic. Uh, as you know, right now, they have 27,000 soldiers. So in addition to the wall, we have uh, Soldiers. Now, the wall still obviously has uh, a ways to go, but we're building it at a breakneck <coughs> next speed. I wanted them to show you the interior of parts of the wall and what's inside of each individual slat. And uh, you'll see it's a combination of steel, concrete, and as one of the folks just said, it really is virtually impenetrable. Here, this goes down. The concrete goes down very deep. It's very hard to tunnel. You can't tunnel. It's actually dangerous, but at a certain point, you hit rock so you can't tunnel. So we have it covered underground, we have it covered overground. And this is, as I said, this is the finest you can do. Uh, I said, let's do it uh, differently. We don't have to go 30 feet. They said, sir, if you don't go 30 feet, it won't be the same because of the climb. Uh, we actually uh, built prototypes and we have, I guess you could say world-class mountain climbers. We got climbers. We had 20 mountain climbers. That's all they do. They love to climb mountains. Uh, they can have it. Me, I don't want to climb mountains, but they're very good. And uh, some of them were champions. And we gave them different prototypes of walls. And this was the one that was hardest to climb. And we've all seen the pictures of young people climbing uh, walls with uh, drugs on their back. A lot of drugs. I mean, they're unbelievable climbers. This wall can't be climbed. This is very, very hard. And what the panel does on top, as I said, is structural, but it's also very hard to get by that panel. Plus, it's designed to absorb heat, so it's extremely hot. The wall is, uh, you won't be able to touch it. You can, you can uh, fry an egg on that wall. It's very, very hot. So if they're going to climb it, they're going to have to bring hoses and waters, uh, water, and we don't know where they're going to hook it up because there's not a lot of water out here. We have a world-class security system at the border, including the highest technology, uh, I would think that there's no place like this anywhere. There's no place has anything like this or even close to it.